Still in the Bono East region, residents of Kunsu, a predominantly farming community in the Kintampo North Municipality, want government to help construct the road network linking the community to its district capital. The deplorable nature of the road network, according to the people, is adversely affecting economic activities in the area. Anas Sabit again. Kunsu is a predominantly farming community in the Kintampo North Municipality of the Bono East region. The deplorable nature of the road network linking this community to its district capital is heavily affecting all phases of life, including healthcare delivery and general economic activities. Rose Jamra is the Kunsu East Assemblywoman. She says the deplorable nature of the road network remains the community's major challenge. Our first challenge is the road. The road from Kentampu to Kunsu is very, very bad. When an uh, emergency comes to the facility, the, I mean the hospital, uh -huh, the clinic at Kunsu, when they have emergency, let's say in the night, uh, a pregnant woman will come for delivery. And if they can uh, assess the problem, they have to take the person or transfer the woman to Kentampo. But due to the problem on the road, you know, it will be difficult for them to move the person to uh, can tampot to sustain her life. So this is the problem we are facing. Chief of the area, Nana Osahene Kweku Krantin II, bemoans how the terrible nature of the road is obviously affecting farming activities in the area. It does have an effect. What effect? Because women cannot even carry their food stuff to the main market. We have plenty of food here. Because people here are farmers. See? This year, for instance, most of them have lost their cashew, fire burning, and all these things. But the government is eager, see, trying to come to our aid and help us in all sphere of life. I think we will not absorb it. But we are not getting that. Although I'm doing my part to sell it out. Yet, no response. Newly installed in Koswahima of the community, Dr. Selim Piesma, who visited the community to finish her residency in global health and tropical medicine, expressed gratitude to the people for the honor and noted that she would work with the people to help improve the Kunsu Health Center. What I really wanted to do, to really have a small clinic that needs improval, that needs someone to take care of them, and improve the health system. When I did my residency back at home in the Netherlands, we've been taught to work together, to cooperate with chiefs, with local people, to enhance the health care. And I will ensure the royal family, but also all the people of Kunsu and the surrounding, that I will do everything in my power to help them. Because I believe that health care is super important um, and, yeah, the best way for it is to help him improve that. Osahini Kweku Krantin II appealed to the media to bring to light the difficulties the people go through in order to help get the road constructed. We cannot do it. The governor's agencies who are responsible for various sectors. And the sector minister who is responsible for this, Mr. of and Lord Lewisburg, they don't mind. They don't mind. So... I charge you now. I'm charging you now. You have to you have the media. Push it. Reporting for Joy News. Anas Sabit. Kunsu.